When it comes to the cattle industry in Northern Australia, it's hard to go past Brahmins. From humble beginnings in 1933, their numbers have grown to become the dominant force in Australia's Northern cattle industry and the standard by which others are compared. In fact, over 50% of Australia's national herd now contains some Brahmin blood. Brahmins look different to other breeds because they are different. It is their unique biology and metabolic functions which make them among the most highly adapted beef cattle in the world. They can survive and reproduce under harsh conditions with the ability to thrive and produce quality beef when adequate nutrition is provided. Others may claim to provide adaptability but it is the Brahmin that sets the standard. Drought survival is linked to a low maintenance requirement, an ability to recycle nutrients including nitrogen, phosphorus and sulphur, to maintain higher feed intake levels on low quality roughages, slower rate of protein turnover, less urination and excretion of urea, higher blood protein level, lower volume of rumen liquid, higher concentration of bacterial fat in the rumen, Heat tolerance is linked to a more efficient sweating mechanism, lower water intake requirement, sleek coat type and dark pigmented skin, extra skin area, slower metabolic rate. Disease and parasite resistance is linked to stronger immune response when challenged by disease or parasites better directed protein metabolism, production of more white cells and focused protein synthesis on required antibody production. Short sleek coat discourages attachment of tick larvae. For an animal to be able to express its genetic potential it must be able to overcome the stresses imposed by the production environment. With climate change increasing seasonal variability, Brahmins are the natural choice to help manage this increased risk to production. In the more temperate areas, Brahmins are being used extensively for crossbreeding. Their ability to produce maximum hybrid vigour in their offspring is an important economic advantage as producers are forced to cast aside breed prejudices in search of greater economic returns. Marketing flexibility is also an important criterion in maximizing profits in uncertain times. And that's what you have with Brahmins. From live exports to premium EU and Jap ox carcass markets, Brahmins fit the bill on grass or grain. And it is their ability to finish on grass after only a short season that is a real benefit. It avoids having to carry over steers to next season or a forced grain feeding option that reduces profit margins. Brahman Breed Plan, ABBA's leading edge genetic evaluation, plays an important role in the genetic advancement of the breed. Estimated breeding values for economically important traits, including post weaning gain, female reproduction, scrotal circumference, eye muscle area, and retail beef yield, all show improving genetic trends. In a world first, a marker assisted EBV for sheer force or tenderness was released in 2008. The growth and development of the Australian Brahmin has been described as the greatest livestock revolution in history. The Australian Bureau of Agricultural and Resource Economics estimates there are more than 110,000 Brahmin bulls working north of the Tropic of Capricorn, 
representing 70% of the bulls working in this area. And based on 20% annual replacements, there is a requirement for 22,000 replacement Brahmin bulls annually. Research has shown that the increased use of Brahmin genetics in the Australian beef industry between 1970 and 2000 amounted to a farm gate benefit of $10.2 billion. More than 90% of the benefits from all forms of genetic improvement during that period. The backline that lifts the bottom line. Invest in Brahman efficiency.